Hello and welcome back to another episode of Ruda Hullet. It is now episode 27 and in today's episode it is another 90 plus Brazilian France Netherlands icon pack. My champs, rewards and gameplay. So let's get into it. Okay, so into the gameplay for champs we go. Now this week I finished rank 6 from champs or in champs but obviously you know that and for me the gameplay was sort of really hit and miss now the first 10 games that i played i won six the second lot of games i only won three now what changed i really don't know but there was just something within the gameplay that just changed massively and there were so many games that I lost by one goal and it would just be some stupid long shot from like 40 yards out and for some reason Van der Sar just cannot deal with them to save his life there's also a lot of times where a strike would be one on one with him and he would just concede really basic shots and it's just infuriating because I know that I can hit rank 5 consistently and when you don't or when I don't I personally I don't know if I'm actually putting pressure on myself to perform because I know that I'm uploading these and that I want to try and give you actually half decent rewards now you'll see my champs rewards after the gameplay and I did actually get something really good but normally the higher you finish up the better rewards you get and it's just disappointing because my team is really good now i think the one thing that did change between my first set of 10 and my last set of 10 is premium footies sent just now whether he made an impact well a negative impact I don't really think he did it's just the gameplay was awful and it sounds like an excuse but anyone that actually plays FIFA genuinely knows that the gameplay depending on the time of day can either be really good or really bad and with all that being said I'll be back with my champs rewards very shortly Okay, so into my champs rewards we go now as I said finished rank 6 so my two picks were an 84 plus and a shapeshifters or e-figs team of the season which I got Raphael Leal which is incredible from my 50k pack I got one to work Bergvine and then my 100k pack I got winter wild cards fabio not too bad okay so next we're looking at my 90 plus brazilian french or dutch icon pack now last time i got foot birthday desai who you'll see in this actually went straight back into the sbc just because I'm never going to use him so I didn't really feel the need for keeping him so 84 88 and 89 rated squads as you can see completed it who did I get only a prime was Dutch it was Edwin van der Sar into the last part of this episode of Ruder Hullet now with footies and best of there is this player pick and i decided to do seven they're definitely not worth it that is my conclusion that i came to after doing seven of them now i was really hoping for something big but as you'll see over the next i think it's about 100 seconds 
just absolutely nothing good. I mean, my best were Rule Breakers PK, as you can see on the screen right now. And then there is a Champions League Foden. So, 289s to be your best, especially as Team of the Weeks have gone through the roof. Now, obviously, there is the sort of daily repeatable Team of the Week pack. But because you can only do it once a day, you can't actually rinse and repeat this SBC. So, you then have to go and buy tradable Team of the Weeks. They're all up at like 30k. I bought three Team of the Weeks and it just definitely isn't worth it as I never got anything higher than an 89 rated card. I'd like to thank you all for watching this episode of Ruta Hullet. If you did enjoy it, drop a like, hit that subscribe button if you're new and don't want to miss out on any FIFA 23 content. But for now, I'll see you in the next one.